Please listen carefully. Morning, Alex. In my professional writing class, we're at the point where we're laying out our documents in a visually appealing way. And in doing that, you want to fill the text boxes with text, but you don't want to fill it with words that you're necessarily going to recognize because that will pull you away from looking at the flow. And for the most part, people use something called lorem ipsum. Now, lorem ipsum comes from the text The Extremes of Good and Evil, written by Cicero about 45 BC. And it's just Latin words that most of us wouldn't understand because we don't speak Latin. It looks something like this. Lorem ipsum dolor sita met consectatur a dispissing elite. Which translates roughly, loves or pursues or desires to obtain pain of itself because it is pain. That's a bit old school. Everybody's been using lorem ipsum. So I wanted to show you some of the more fun ways you can fill in random text when you're laying out a document. Now in our class we use something called hipster ipsum, which is similar to lorem ipsum in that it, it's text that might not distract you terribly, but with a more hipster twist. PBR and B3. Wolf Moon 4 Loco Fap Direct Trade Bespoke Finger Stash Chambray Squid Cred Church Key Tumblr Swag Viral Food Truck Banjo Odd Furniture. That sounds like Portland all over. Now these next few probably aren't as helpful as Hipster Ipsum in taking the place of Lorem Ipsum, but I think you'll enjoy these just as well. This one's called Fillerama. What are their names? Now now, perfectly symmetrical violence never solved anything. Kids have names? Hey, what you watching? Check it out, y'all. Everyone who is invited is here. Philorama basically just pulls random quotes from Futurama. You can also set it to different shows like Arrested Development, Star Trek, Dexter, Doctor Who, etc. But I felt since it was called Philorama, I should use the Futurama text. Okay, this one's probably my favorite one out of all of them. This one's called Samuel L. Ipsum. Do you see any Teletubbies in here? Do you see a slender plastic tag clipped to my shirt with my name printed on it? Do you see a little Asian child with a blank expression on his face sitting outside on a mechanical helicopter that shakes when you put quarters in it? No? Well that's what you see at a toy store. And you must think you're in a toy store because you're here shopping for an infant named Jib. Oh Samuel L. Jackson, you don't take crap from anybody. Now pick some is sort of similar, but you can pick two actors to go head to head in sort of a random mishmash of quotes from both of them. So I chose Morgan Freeman and Michael Caine. You're as precious to me as you were to your own mother and father. I swore to them that I would protect you and I haven't. You wouldn't hit a man with no trousers on, would you? You're only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. Well, what is it today? More spelunking? You're only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. I took a Viagra, got stuck in my throat. I've had a stiff neck for hours. Bruce, I'm God. But last line, I'm not sure if that was Michael Caine or Morgan Freeman. Both of them could have said Bruce, I'm God at one point or another. Now, if you want to be a little more upper class with your filler text, I recommend Literati, where you can pick an author and a book, and it'll just pick a random point in that book to start, and it will give you every paragraph that follows after that. Now, I'm a fan of Herman Melville's Moby Dick, and so this is what I got. I protested my innocence of these things. I saw that under the mask of these half-humorous innuendos, this old seaman, as an insulated Quakerish Nantucketer, was full of his insular prejudices, and rather distrustful of all aliens unless they hailed from Cape Cod or the Vineyard. Now, I've saved one of the funniest ones for last, because I know you're a fan of Game of Thrones, this is Hodor Ipsum. Hodor, 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 Hodor. Which is really difficult to say really fast. Anyways, Alex, I know that you don't really do laying out of documents, you're more of actually writing things, but I thought you would enjoy these, and if you ever do need to lay out documents, please feel free to peruse the wonderful internet of miscellaneous Ipsums. I've put the links to all of the ones that I've discussed in this vlog below for anybody who wants to look into them. If anybody knows of any other alternative lorem ipsums please let me know i find these absolutely hilarious anyways alex i have no idea what to do for the hunter's vlog i feel like maybe i should have saved this one for that because i feel like whatever i come up with is not going to be as funny as hodor ipsum on that note also i want to see you try and say hodor five times as fast as you possibly can uh just record that put it at the start of the end of your next vlog it would make my day anyways alex i'll see you for number 99 tomorrow Hodor, 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 Hodor.